Tommy is on his way home and I ordered some like sea food. In Dutch we say sea fruit. I don't know if you say it in English too. So it's a mix of shrimps, lobster, oyster, things all in one bag. And I think we're going to make some seafood kind of pasta. And yeah, I'm excited for him to come home because we are gonna cook together and yeah, I'm very hungry and I'm excited, so. So we have the seafood things here in a little bag and then some gluten-free pasta and some vegetables and since we're trying to cut carbs a little bit lately, I think we want it to be more vegetables than pasta. So pasta is cooking and I just took out the seafood and I took out all of the surimi in between because I mean I always do that since I learned what surimi is made of and yeah it looks so good wow looks good so we're going to enjoy our pasta and we're gonna watch some gossip girl mm -hmm. so <laughs> these cocktail um, things from H&M Home and I'm usually more of a silverware kind of person and lately I've been loving everything silver like teacups, a teapot, just everything that we have is at the moment more silvery than gold but I thought the gold was so cute for like the holidays in the winter I just thought it was a bit of a warmer tone it would look a little bit more sparkly and glamorous so I just ordered both and I thought I would just see and I also think it's fun to use them both and just mix them so hi I just showered and got ready and I put my hair up in a braid so that I have some loose waves tomorrow because I'm going to work and I cut up some fruits for us we have a very big fit peach we have some plums some cherries and very ripe banana and we're going to watch some gossip girl again so good morning guys we just arrived in knoka and yeah tommy is going to get some pastries because we were very much in the mood for that and i'm gonna be working all day here and he also took his like his laptop and his um camera gear and he just has to work too so i think he's going to settle himself in a little cafe or something and just like work while I'm working too and then when I'm having lunch we're gonna have lunch together and then also dinner and then we go home so okay we came back from my work an hour and a half two hours ago we passed by my parents because they're back from their vacation and I saw my little sister back and I'm so happy to see her back and she was so tense she was like I was like this and she was like this so I refreshed myself a little bit and I put on another outfit we're going to some kind of little event um, tiny mini concert thing in our um, in like the center of our town and we don't like these things at all but this time it is a colleague of Tommy that is part of the organization so we thought we might pass by to say hi I bought something from Zara home I just bought another big basket I like that this is white compared to the traditional brown color of baskets in general I also got this like plate holder it's not a book holder because i tried it and it did not work but got this plate holder too because because i bought some plates to match with our other porcelain pieces from hermes so got an orange box 
They come in a set of two and these are the soup plates. It's just like a traditional kind of soup plate with then the Hermes design. Uh, I remember the first time we bought a few pieces of this collection and like the woman that worked at Hermes told me or told us about the story behind this design and obviously there is a double H because it refers to, and yes, I'm gonna say it in French, Hermes and Hollande. It refers and hints to like their wedding and where it took place. And yeah, as I said, I would like to have the full collection, but just for us two for now. So I would like to have two pieces of everything. So these plates are going on this plate holder in our glass cabinet where all of our beautiful pieces are. Uh, and then we're still looking forward to get the dinner plates the decorative like big plates the butter and bread plates the dessert plates i think that's it and they also have this collection in like a more reddish color but we like just this one because it's very timeless this sweater is from h&m it is a very big size i think this is either medium or a large and then this skirt is either from Zara or H&M as well, I don't know. Um, but it's just this very long white skirt. And the little sandals are Chanel. My little bag is, how do you say it in English? It's a Degas and Voltaire, whatever. Um, I did not want to pair Chanel's with Chanel's because this thing is really not a big deal. I'm having a coffee and this is really a guilty pleasure of mine. I don't know if anyone does this, but I love to have like sweet raisiny bread with butter and cheese and Tommy does not like this at all he cannot understand how I would be possibly able to like this but I love this and yeah I'm gonna enjoy this now so Okay, I'm wearing a hat because Tommy decided to wear a hat too, but I think it's very appropriate. It's Christmas in August. Okay, guys, I think we're gonna buy this chair. Uh, I like this one actually a little bit more, but I don't think it's gonna fit in the place we would want it to fit. And this one is just kind of, it's the same idea. I think this pillow makes it a bit softer and maybe it's going to break up the harsh texture of the wood because most of our like home things are white and very light color so i think this would be cute together too okay tommy is in love with these two um what do you call them two one seaters lounge chairs and they are for sale for like no money but we don't have space for these last year we came here around christmas and we bought a lot of those um, wooden puzzle things. We had, we had an Eiffel Tower, like that one, and a few other things. And we were so excited to make them, but then we never did. Uh, we started the Eiffel Tower though, and then it was complicated and we stopped. But these are really, really cool. Okay, I'm going to show what we got in a minute, but I first want to see how this chair is gonna look. Wow, pillow feels so good. It looks like it's such good quality and it is double-sided. Most of the times they only make like one side pretty, for example, like this one. For example, like this one is very pretty on one side and then the other side you literally have to hide i mean this is fine but i don't like how they designed the zipper to be here so 
I love this one. I think it's cute. I think it's very summery and linen-y, but I feel like that one just looks way more qualitative and also it matches with everything else. So also got a wooden elephant that looked like the one Hermes um, sells, but, but we thought this one was so cute and it matches all the other wooden things we have. And I think I'm gonna put it in the class cabinets. We also got this thing and in Dutch we say garaf. I don't really know what you say, like decanter maybe in English. And I think this would be so nice on like a desk. And it is a decanter and then a glass in one. And we actually have we actually have glasses from Firm Living that are also like rippled and Firm Living also sells the decanter together with the glass. But I think that one is around 40 euros and this one was only like 7 or 8 euros and I just thought this looked so cool, especially for the price, so we got one like that. Okay, we got some cards, I think these are 5 pieces, yes, uh, with little sausage dogs on them and we really have a thing for sausage dogs, so I also got, I also don't know what they call this in English, they say scot. In Dutch, whenever I cook and I'm in a hurry, I sometimes get dirty a bit or I smell like the food or my clothes smell like it. And I don't really like that, so I got this one and I know that it's a bit playful, but we have matching um, like oven gloves. Is that what you call them? I don't know. I, I can't find my words in English now, but we have those gloves that you put on to get your stuff out of the oven with the exact same with the exact same design, so I think this would match. Then we got this big wooden plate to put snacks on it, and we thought just all these wooden things would match perfectly together, so. Okay, Tommy found this beautiful box. So it is initially for, I mean, I can't, I don't think you can use it for anything else outside of cards, mm -hmm. but we're going to put these beautiful cards in there instead of the red ones. And we <laughs> told ourselves we're going to get some Hermes playing cards too and then we're gonna put them in there and then we're gonna put them on the like the living room coffee table and then it's so cool if you open this and you see like the Hermes playing cards, I think it's so cool. We also got this cute little set, this is organic cotton and it is like a little gift set with a hat and a swaddle, I think that's what they call it and they have little cats on it. We also, I mean, Tommy also got these, um, I don't think it's marble, it's probably some other stone, but, uh, but this one is for toothbrushes and this one is like a soap dish and I'm not sure yet how they're gonna look in the bathroom, I'll show it later, but Tommy really liked these ones, so we got these two. And then lastly, we got two of these white art pieces with these light wooden frames. Okay, I'm just quickly going to show where and how we give everything a place. So the place from yesterday, I put them up here and I felt like it was very empty there to just have glasses because those are see-through and then these three things are like white and you can see them from afar so I either wanted something else over there or I wanted to add something I really like how the wood matches with the boat and also with the little um, woven rack behind there and we have a lot of wooden things in the home so I guess this makes sense moving to the bedroom I hung up those two like art pieces. I do honestly really like how it looks. We like it to be a bit more minimal but but whenever we like gave someone a tour of our bedroom they said it was like very empty and very minimal. The only thing is I still hate the color of the headboard of the bed. I think we either gonna get another headboard or we're gonna get a headboard cover because I don't like how... I just don't like the gray. And for the ones that don't know, this is the only furniture piece Tommy ever bought without my consent. He just bought it without thinking, knowing this was a good idea, but I hate the gray so much. And I try to make it work and work around it, but I just don't like it. And then these two bathroom accessories that I showed. I also showed the metal rack that we bought from Ikea in the last video, but then I did not show it 
excuse my phone then i did not show it when we installed it but it looks like this back with the sushi but we're not watching gossip girl tonight we're watching this series called knock, knock off. Uh, me, yeah yeah uh, yeah it's called knock off like knock off but it is filmed in knocka and apparently it is not very good but it's new so yeah let's give it a try mm -hmm. 